So some quick instructions on how to download a book from our BarrowBox app or BarrowBox service using a Microsoft device such as a laptop, a desktop or um, Surface Pro. So first of all, go to our library homepage, which is monahan.ie forward slash library and click into your online library. That will bring you to all of our online services. So we have the ebooks, the magazines, online classes, progress, but we want to look in particular at BarrowBox. So if you click into BarrowBox, it will bring you to this. Um, obviously you need to sign in. So to log in, it will ask you for your library card number and PIN. If you haven't got that, you will need to contact library staff to find out your PIN number. Your library barcode is the number on your card. So once you have signed in, um, you can see it will give your account details here. So we want to look in particular for ebooks today. So we can click on our ebooks. Have a browse through, see if there's anything you're interested in. Um, you have your different categories here as well. So say for example, I want to borrow 50 great life lessons. I just click borrow and confirm the ebook loan. Now, if you're doing this on an app, the BorrowBox app, it will allow you to start to download straight away. But because we're doing this on a Microsoft device, we have to download Adobe Digital Editions as that's the software that allows us to read the ebooks online. So if you click download it now, it will bring you to the Adobe page and prompt you to download. So it's the Windows device you want to click on. So if you click on that, it'll ask you what to do. So you want to run it and that will work away. So once you have that downloaded, it will add a link to your desktop. So you can see there we have the Adobe Digital Editions. But for now, so once you have that downloaded, then you have to go back and download the actual book. So we click on download for e-reader. So then once you have started to download, you want to save it as, now what I find is really useful is if you create an ebooks folder on your desktop or in your documents for everyone, save it. So once you have your folder created, then save as, you can see here, I have my ebooks folder and I also find it useful to name the file, the name of the book. So in this case, it's 50 Great Life Lessons. So once you have that done, if you go back into your Adobe Digital Editions, now there's a couple of things you need to do here. First of all, you have to authorize the computer. So if you do have an Adobe account, you can enter it here. If not, you can continue without an ID. So just tick that wee button, go next and authorize it. Okay. And once you have authorized your computer, then you want to go into file and you want to add to your library. So if you click that, and we're going to add to our library from the folder that we created earlier. So here I have my ebooks downloads. And actually see here where it says ebooks, change that to Adobe. And you'll find your Adobe books that you've downloaded. So it was 50 Great Life Lessons. If I open that, that will add it then to my Adobe Digital Editions library. 